Hello, I'm Talia Andrews and welcome to the UK edition of TDTV. The European Commission has approved proposals for British Airways, American Airlines and Iberia to launch a transatlantic joint business later this year. The carriers are awaiting a final decision on antitrust immunity from the US Department of Transportation before the deal is secured. The approval has also confirmed the merger of BA and Iberia and has allowed the One World Alliance to boost its presence in the Atlantic. In other news, year-on-year -year passenger numbers have increased by 8.52% at Bristol Airport throughout June. Numbers on international flight routes have increased by 13.2% in the past six months despite the volcanic ash cloud crisis. Bristol Airport Aviation Director Sean Brown said demand for business and leisure travel was returning to the level seen before the recession hit. Meanwhile, medical tourists are heading to Poland for cheaper surgical treatments according to a new research from Texai. The country anticipates more than 15% growth in the country's health tourism market, particularly from the UK and Germany. Polish National Tourist Office representatives have said the combination of leisure attractions and health services would attract visitors. Land Airlines have announced it will start a Lima to Easter Island service next year. The new route will operate on Wednesdays and Saturdays beginning on the 5th of January 2011. And finally, research from ebookers.com shows US hotels are offering the best customer experience. Meanwhile, Mediterranean destinations such as Spain, France and Greece were shown to offer the worst hotels. The ebookers survey which questioned 2,000 travellers found cleanliness, location and value for money were considered the key elements of a quality property. That's it for today. Thanks for watching the UK edition of TDTV. We'll see you again tomorrow.